guys, welcome back to my channel, Peppermint Crinkles. This is Anne. Uh, today I'll be doing a kind of just a neutral everyday look. I know I've done so much neutrals, but I just love the look. The focus. And the eyeshadows that I use came from this palette, Too Faced uh, Naked Eyes palette. So if you want to see how I did this look, then continue watching. Alright, so I've already uh, primed my lids and make this as my base. This is MAC uh, Paint Pot in Mobile. I put it all over my lid and a little bit underneath on my lower lash line. Next, I'm going to take now my Too Faced uh, Naked Eye Palette. First, I'm going to take this... Um, satin sheets right here using this essence eyeshadow brush put that on the two thirds of my lid up to the crease then using the same brush I'm just going to use the other side like convergent right here on the outer corner of the lid and then on my lower lash line next taking this elf blending brush taking this pillow top right here this will be on my crease just to soften up those edges and of course what's left on the brush on my lower lash line and of course a little bit in between that satin sheets and like a virgin taking this essence crease brush I'm going to apply unmentionables this one right here that on the other corner Coastal Sense BRC S06 blend this is Coastal Sense Divine Eyeshadow Brush in the buff right here this will be as my highlight For my liner, I'm going to use Stiletto right here. Angle brush from Essence. bit on my lower lash line on my waterline I'm going to apply this Rimmel uh, scandalized uh, Col Kajal liner in nude Tony Molly eyelash curler to curl my lashes for my mascara uh, Maybelline great lash mascara I'm not going to put any on my lower lash line, I'm not a fan. Then on top of that, it's my Etude House OM Eyelash Top Coat. Hi guys, so this is the finished look. I hope that you enjoyed the tutorial and you love the look. So, that's the look. Right, so these are the products I use for the rest of my face. Face, are. Uh, for my moisturizer, I'm using this Olato FX. For my under eye moisturizer, I'm using my Elf Daily Moisture Stick. And this is Skin Food Salmon Eye Brightening Cream. For my lips, I prepped it with my Body Shop Vitamin E. 
for my primer this is Tarte Clean Slate Poreless uh, 12 hour perfecting primer for my foundation Bourjois Healthy Mix Serum Gel Foundation and my shade is 51 on Vanilla Clear for my brows I used uh, Great Lash Clear Mascara and this eyeshadow MAC Coquette pretty pretty shade I love it for my lids NYX eyeshadow base in white for my facial concealment uh, Revlon Photo Ready concealer stick in white for my cream um, highlight Me 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 Beat the Blues in Sunbeam which is I think this is dupe for the benefit one I don't know which one for my cream contour bourgeois um, bronzing primer for my cream blush um, NYX boho chic for my under eye corrector I used my pixie correction concentrate in brightening peach for my concealer under eye concealer this is Misha uh, signature extreme cover concealer and my shade is uh, 21 for my under eye brightener I'm using this uh, Coastal Sense Bright Eyed Eye Brightener in Ivory to set my under eye yeah, under eye corrector and concealer I'm using this Ben Nye Banana Luxury Powder to set my foundation and cream products, MAC MSF Natural in Light Plus. For my all over bronzer, by the way, this is NYC Sun and Bronze Bronzing Powder, and the shade is Coney Island Glow. For my powder contour, MAC Harmony. For my blush, I'm using this MAC MSF in lust for my highlight I use this MAC special reserve highlighting powder in Rosie Olay on my lips I used my sleek makeup pout polish in bare minimum I set my makeup using my vanilla and company which is a beauty tonic and of course um, on my nails um, this is where are you China glaze hook and line like that. which is I think from the Hunter Games collection I don't know. so that is it guys thank you very much for watching God bless and bye